Ten years ago, my father and I had a fight. A big fight. Up until now, every generation of our family has owned this restaurant. From my grandfather and his brother in Sicily to my father and my uncle. That's what it means, actually. Fratelli means brothers. And then, my dad goes and has two daughters. My sister and I. My uncle never had kids, so as far as the family bloodline goes, I don't ever think he thought we would succeed him in the restaurant. I don't ever think he was very proud of having daughters, actually. Still, they loved it here. We were here all the time. This was our home. Sometimes, when my dad wasn't around, sneak up here and we'd um, make up recipes and we'd pretend that we were cooking for celebrities and kings. Back here where we really found ourselves. So, uh, years later, I approached my father with the idea of my sister and I going to culinary school. He wouldn't hear. He said it wasn't my place. He said that it was about time that I met a nice Sicilian boy and got married and started popping out grandkids. He didn't get it. So, without telling him, without telling anybody, I applied to culinary school. And I got in. <laughs> Culinary Institute of New York City. God. I can still see the lettering on the envelope. I think I pulled it out of the mailbox. And you, you would think that I would have been afraid to tell him that I would have been worried what he would say, but... I was sure. I was sure that he would be so proud of me. He went ballistic. He tore the envelope up and he threw it in my face. And I said, I'm going anyway. And he said, if you go, don't bother ever coming. So that night, after closing, I went into the office and I took the weekend earnings out of the safe. And I walked out the back door with my acceptance letter and $8,000 in my pocket. And I didn't even say goodbye to myself.